In this tutorial, you're going to learn how to install and customize FreeDB Call to Action modules. First thing you want to do is to import the modules into our DB library. To do so, go to DB, then DB library. Click Import and Export button. Select Import, then choose File. Navigate to files you downloaded. This free pack contains three Call to Action modules. If you don't need all of them, but only one, you can import only one of the three modules by selecting individual JSON files. For this tutorial, I'm going to use main JSON file that is going to import all three of them. Also, there is a CSS file that we are going to use in a moment. Select your file and click Open. Then click the Import button. After the successful import, you are going to see modules in your library. Now let's add these modules to our page. Go to the page and click Add from Library. Select the modules you would like displayed on your page. I am going to select all three of them. Now that we have the modules on our page, we also have to add the CSS. To do so, go to the CSS file in your archive file you downloaded as shown previously. Copy all the codes in it. Then go back to the page and click Settings icon. Paste the CSS into custom CSS box. Then click Save and update the page. Let's preview. And there we go. Nice looking call to action modules. Let me now show you how you can customize these modules and change the text and button colors. Let's start with the module 1. If you want to change the color of this text and this button here, simply go to the module settings. Select Design tab and then change Title Text Color. You can also change a Body Text Color and of course Button Color. Don't forget to change the Button Hover Color and Button Border Color if it has one. And let's save and preview. There we go. This doesn't look so nice, but you see how you can change it. Also, the whole section has the background image you can change by going to section settings, then changing the background image. It is exactly the same for other two modules. For example, let's go to the module 2, again select settings and design tab, scroll down to title, color, also body text color, then the button background color, button hover text color, then button Hover background color, save and let's preview. And there we go. That's really all for these call to action modules and for this tutorial.